Laura, how, Alf's a bit of a seasoned campaigner, but how has he travelled out here to Rotterdam? Um, he's feeling very well, yeah, he's very fit, very strong and in better form than ever, I think, so feeling well, that's, happy. That's tremendous news. Now, we've come to the end of the first day of the team competition. What are your feelings about today? Oh, I couldn't be happier. Um, both my teammates had a really good good rides. Emile started off with a with a good score and a and a, and a really um, yeah a solid round, and then Charlotte went and got a personal best, which you can't really ask for more than that at a championship. And it was a fantastic, fantastic ride, very inspirational. So um, yeah, I think it's uh, going to be very exciting. Tell me just in a, in a few words about your preparation for tomorrow. You know, with Alf in the morning and, and what you'll be doing. Tomorrow morning we get the opportunity to go into the main arena and have a look and show the horses you know, the way it's going to be set up fully for the test. Um, show them the cameras and, and the scary things like that. So I'll do that in the morning first thing early and then I won't ride him too long before his actual test, probably not more than half an hour before his test, um, just to make sure he's nice and awake and supple and feeling good and then we'll go in there and do our thing hopefully. Of course being a team competition, do you, do you feel any more pressure than as an individual or, or is it you just feel all the same? Definitely more, more pressure for the team because it's, um, you know, you're, you're not just doing it for yourself, you're doing it for the others and, and you, know, you know how much everyone wants it and you definitely feel a certain amount of responsibility, um, especially I'm last to go so you kind of, you know exactly where you're at by then but um, at the same time it's, it's good pressure because it's, it's an opportunity to be taken and you know, we're under pressure because, um, because we've been doing well and, and that should also give us confidence. Well, Great Britain have followed you both at Windsor last year and, of course, at the World Equestrian Games, and they'll be following you tomorrow. You must enjoy having the country behind you. Absolutely. Um, no, it's, it's, it's great to know that you've got lots of supporters and, um, you know, it's just a, a sort of a small little sort of thing compared to what it's going to be like next year. So, um, no, it's very exciting. Great. Well, the very best of luck with you and Alf tomorrow. Thank you. Thanks very much.